My girl has a shop here. I can restore or repair a car right here in this shop. Okay? I need a car desperately, America. I've given you 15 years of investigation with Spec Ops, ex Secret Service, and military. I had a shop too, and a restoration business, and three Italian restaurants. 14 cars are gone. My dragon bike was a Harley Davidson, all customized, and my son's bike, Ninjitsu. I stripped my studio, my custom van, and my race car. Stripped. All my keyboards and guitars are gone. I just wrote 20 songs. I'm a singer and songwriter and entrepreneur. The police denied my family justice. Twelve people wiped out. And all my credit cards, checks, and everything were taken and used. I've lost everything. Everything I've lost. I own nothing. Even my clothing, boots, hats, jeans, buckles, everything gone. Armani suits. My house was all western. Everything is gone. They even took our horses, saddles, and tack. And 14 old west guns were taken, two Stradivarius violins, and seven works of art. The coin collection was valued at $67 million. It was rare coins. My father invested all his benefits for 12 people. Yeah, come a police officer. David Cortez said, if you can help us, Alex, we'd really appreciate it. So I went out and got him all the evidence. Some of the members of the family that knew me, who ripped me off, said, we can't believe they did this to you. You're one of the coolest people in Yakima. Yeah, I was. I helped everybody I could. I need your help, America. It's your turn. I put out $39,000 on my disability in these 15 years working with Spec Ops, Sex Secret Service, Military, and thousands of patriots nationwide. All I'm asking is, hey, skip a cup of coffee or something. Send me five bucks. If enough of you, send me five dollars to my address. I will put it in a bank account till it grows to put a good down payment on a car. You see, on my income, I can't save that kind of money. I have to pay for a living. I have to pay for my life. And on my income of $770 a month, I'm way below poverty. So I need your help desperately, America. Please help us.